Hey guys, I'm back again with another uh, reaction video to the latest Supernatural episode of season 15. Um, this is epo episode 17 called Unity. Um, so let's jump into it. All right, let's go. Let's watch this. Tomorrow, I'm thinking. Jack kills her. Then there's no God, there's no darkness. We'll see. It's time to clear the board. It's time to start unwinding whole worlds. We want to take your brother down. We need your help. Our pal, Jack. He'll be strong enough to trap Chuck. I'll think about it. Yo, Feathers. Oh, we're on the same side against Chuck. I'm on Death's side. When a plan works, I finally get to go back to school. She's so, seeing all these recaps on it. This is amazing. Jack's done with all the other worlds and he'll be here any day. And when he does, Jack's gonna die. How can you keep me in the dark about something so huge? Because I know you couldn't handle it. No! This is how we end Chuck. Just stop! Iceland. Mr. Meravin? Nay. Welcome home, brother. Spell so powerful it could quote. Just that rumor. I just, I don't know what else to do. That's all right. We'll find the way. I guess. So this is going to be give me the silent treatment. I'm not sure what you want me to say. That you get it. Like I said, killing Amara, Jack dying. That's the only way. And stuff like that. We don't have to like it. All right, but you and me, we got to get it done. Sam, Dean, we should talk. My brother has returned. That means it's time. Nope. We got one, Jack. I wish we'd gotten to know one another. That's my fault. Maybe when all of this is over, we can. Like I told you when we first met, you and I will always help each other. You're angry with me. No, I'm not angry. I... You're disappointed? Hmm. Yeah. Look. <laughs> I wish you'd have been up front with us. He's got a good face, isn't he? Guys. Takes a lot of courage. Huh. Yeah, um, I'm not coming. <laughs> what? Take you and Jack got this covered. Chuck is back. You want to take a knee? That's not what I'm doing. If you and me, we have to do this, it's in the book. Oh, Chuck's death book, right? Come on, man. Blindly following orders, lying to Amara, sending her to her death. Does any of this feel right to you? It doesn't matter how we feel. <laughs> you know what? Stay. Stay. Huh. Somebody's got to be the grown up here. Yeah, well, someone has to keep fighting for Jack. He knows what he signed up for. Huh. Last I checked, we don't give up on family. Jack's not family. That's pretty harsh. But he's not like you, he's not like Cass. He's just not. 
Um. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think Dean ever got over the fact that Jack killed his mum. Yeah, he never got over it. But that happened. Sam. Stay behind to find another way, huh? I would have done the same. There's always got to be another way. Hey, sis. Did you check out my light show the other night? It's pretty rad, huh? You've been ending worlds. And now you've come for this one? Save the best for last. And then what? You know, I've been asking myself that question a lot lately. What happens after the end? Hmm? Huh? And I have an idea, but I need your help. No, absolutely not. Come on. You know the rules I can create, I can destroy, but I can't do a hard reset, reboot everything without you. Not happening. Walk with me. <sighs> okay, I'm walking. We're walking. You never slow down, do you? Take a breath. Revel in this wonderful thing you created. Right. And this is where you drop some sappy crap about how perfect my first tree was or whatever. Wasn't it, though? Perfect. Yeah, it was pretty sweet. It was a fern. I was obsessed with fractals. Free, not a human. Humans. Ugh, humans are the worst. They're lame. Disappointing. They ruin everything they touch. Heaven? Really? Look, I appreciate the effort, but none of this really lights my wick anymore. So, uh... Remind me. How does your wick feel about fans? Oh, my God. Oh, I mean, oh, my, you. Uh, could, could you sign this for me? <laughs> sure. You are the way and the truth and the light. Cool. Uh, make it out to, to Tally. Actually, um, Crystal, Tally's a nickname. Actually, could you make okay. it out? Oh. Don't worry. They're not gone. They're just away. Oof. I guess don't meet your idols goes both ways. Am I right? So, meeting those mouth breathers was supposed to inspire me to do what? I wanted you to feel their love. Their perfect angelic devotion. I guess that makes you the villain. Can you imagine having that, having that ability to just click oh, and you're somewhere else? Just click. Time forward. Oh. Winchester's bunker. Are they behind that door? Hmm? Is this a parent trap sort of thing? Because no. No way. Hasta la vista. Hasta la... Why is that not working? Hmm. Is this a trap? You don't need to be sorry. I'm not like Sam or Cass. I, I understand. <laughs> Jim's Jim. Chose the spot. Billy said, This is where it ends. Jack? Hello? Hello? Uh, I find it so funny how he does that. Yeah, you know, God's primo. First dude off the assembly line. Wait. The the garden, the apple, that mm -hmm. apple. His aura. I know. It's like Skittles. She's an angel. Yeah, 
She's my old lady. We were sipping mushroom tea in the hanging gardens of Babylon. So you were tripping balls and you saw Jack? Uh-huh. I did it. Far out. Okay, uh, great. Well, now what? <laughs> Whoa, whoa, what the hell are you doing? It's packing enough punch to create life. Or in your case, destroy God. Jack, making your vessel strong, reclaiming your human soul, it was, it was all preparing you for this. What'll it do to me? Start an elemental chain reaction that fuses your soul and your grace into a... Like a mm, metaphysical supernova. You dig? I dig. So I, I, I wanna say, I need to say, Thank you, Jack. Thank you. You're welcome. Understand it. I, I, I feel it too. It's hopelessness. Wait. You remember when Sergey was here? Remember what he was looking for? Yeah, it was the key to death. Yes. But he said it would open the doorway to to death's library. If it's in the bunker, and if we can find it, maybe I can just walk up to her, right? Or, or what, but if Dean beats me back here, buy me some time. Sam Winchester? Meg? Sorry, she's still dead. Just barring the Queen's pretty face, because really I'm empty. Her party line, but she's ignoring me. I hate that. What do you want? The empty was supposed to be mine. Not even God held sway, but lies, sweet little lies. And Billy said when she takes over, she'd make it all better, but then your busted ass friend in a trench coat came along and he gave me these trust issues. Billy wants to take over. Become new God. Everyone back to where they belong. Realities, dimensions, graves. What should be dead dies, angels off earth, demons back to hell, and I go back to sleep. Wait. Stop. Billy sent me. She did one now? Really? She sent me. Really? Because you're saying a lot of dumb stuff for, you know, an emissary of death. We're trying to beat God. I don't have a lot of time for questions. Go on. Billy sent me 
to get the book. She didn't say why. Where is she? Earth. You can't go there, can you? Only if I'm summoned. God's so protective of his little sand castle. Billy will honor her promise. God, Amara, they die. And you, you can go back to sleep. But you kill me, we lose. And you will never go back to sleep. Yes, Sam, finally. What? Tomorrow, she's here with Chuck. It's time. No, 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 Cass. We can't let that happen. We have to stop it. It's not too late, brother. You can still choose this world, us. It doesn't have to end like this. Amara! Shut up. Chuck and Amara cannot die. Wait, I don't understand. Are they ready? We need to get this kid in the room right now. Wait, what did you think? Billy is playing us. So what, her plan's not gonna work? No, it will work. Then great. But listen, if Jack takes out God and Amara, it'll create a power vacuum that Billy will fill. This was all her power grab. Wait, Death wants to become God? Hey, as long as Chuck dies, I'm good. Okay, listen, just stop. Get out of the way, Sam. What are you doing? We don't have time. Jack already lit the fuse, we gotta go. You did what? Sam, I'm not gonna ask you again. Dean, please. This is my ending. Move. Dean, don't. Move, Sam. Move! You orchestrated this. What part of omniscient do you people not understand? Plan a few visions, go death a little, mess with a few outcomes, and bada bing. I mean, <laughs> they think they can kill me? Dean, don't do this. I don't want to do this, but this is everything. Get out of my way. Let's go, let's go. Dean, no, Dean, wait, stop you, you listen. Oh, but, but Dean can't hurt me. Nobody can lie to you. He could send you into the meat grinder with a wink and a smile. You guys, go! Go! Jack, don't! Sam, why not? Because if Billy takes over, then everyone goes back to where they belong. That means everybody. From Apocalypse World, Bobby, Charlie, they get sent back to a place that doesn't exist anymore. And everyone we saved. Eileen, she just dies again. And that's just the beginning. Sam, we don't have a choice. Jack's about to blow! We always have... There's nothing else we can do. Okay? We just gotta get out of the way. No, we can't get out of the way, Dean. Not this time. I don't care if Billy gets what she wants. I don't, man. I trade it all. I trade them all for Chuck. In a heartbeat. What about me? Would you trade me? Alex. Yes. Think of it. Us. Starting fresh. Creating something new, something beautiful, peaceful, together. And we can finally forget about all this pain. No baggage, only balance. To. Otherwise, he'll keep us tap dancing forever. And I can't live like that, man. I can't live like that. I won't. I know you feel like that right now, okay? I know you do. But you gotta trust me. My entire life, you've protected me from dad, from Lucifer, from everything. I didn't always like it, you know? But... It's the one thing in the whole world 
that I can always count on. It's the only thing I've ever known that was true. So please, put the gun away. Just put it away. We'll figure it out. Dean, we'll find another way, you and me. We always do. Are you kidding me? After everything, all that, you, you did it again. Where's Amara? Amara, Amara, she's in here somewhere. What, you consumed your sister? We came to an understanding. So spare me your contempt, Castiel, after gripping him tight and raising him for perdition. They did what they were told, but not you. Not the one off the line with a crack in his chassis. I'm over it. I'm over you. Yeah. Good. Screw you, Chuck. No. Screw you. You know what you do with broken toys. You throw them out. So, kill each other, don't kill each other. I don't care. What do you mean? I mean, have fun watching him not. Oh, <laughs> Help me! Jack! 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 Hey! Jack! That was a very climactic ending to that episode. Chuck consumed Amara, or they, as you said, they came to an agreement. But, again, the emotional scene between Dean, Sam, just as Sam says that Dean always protects him he tries to protect him from stuff but this time Dean must trust Sam he's always trying to protect him he must trust him this time but again I, I, I can't I don't want to see Jack die personally I do not want to see him die he went through too, too much to die and he's now gonna explode without even doing his proper thing but again if you guys if you enjoyed the review uh please leave a comment and a thumbs up and don't forget to share the video as well all right guys but thanks peace out